Prince Charles is the future King of England and was dubbed a gruesome child in a letter written by his aunt following an incident at Balmoral when he was just four years old. Charles was just four years old when his aunt Princess Alexandra was staying at Balmoral and injured herself during a parlor game called Stone. In a handwritten letter addressed to her brother Prince Edward, the Duke of Kent, Princess Alexandra explained how a man called Martin accidentally bit her on the mouth during the game. She wrote, Martin, bit me quite accidentally on the mouth, which was extremely painful. She goes on to detail how unfortunate injury developed into a painful blister after she went on to accidentally bite it and make it bleed. She wrote, so this morning Dr. Middleton came and pierced it. Ho ho. She claimed four-year-old Charles was fascinated by the gruesome procedure and insisted on watching. She added, Charles was fascinated and insisted on watching. Gruesome child don't you think? Princess Alexandra, also known as the Honorable Lady Ogilvy, goes on to tell how she and Prince Philip had an extensive discussion about black stockings during her stay. She wrote, We had a long discussion about black stockings. Too stupid. He is so sweet. The letter which is dated September 21st, details her time at Balmoral where the royals are known to enjoy hunting, shooting and fishing every year. She wrote, There have been shooting lunches most days and mentioned meeting John Slim, a soldier and hereditary peer. I have met him only twice, not a new love if that's what you are thinking. Princess Alexandra, 73, is the youngest granddaughter of King George V and Queen Mary and was a bridesmaid at the Queen Elizabeth II's wedding. In 1963, she married businessman Sir Angus Ogilvy with whom she has two children. The extraordinary letter which has been part of a private collection for more than two decades will be auctioned next year. The handwritten correspondence is expected to sell for around £400. The Queen stays at Balmoral for several months every summer and enjoys hosting friends and family members while there. As well as hunting, shooting and fishing, the royal family enjoy picnics and barbecues on Balmoral's lawn. The Aberdeenshire estate has several lodges as well as the main castle. This year, Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson visited the Queen and Philip in Scotland as did Prince Edward and Sophie Countess of Wessex. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Prime Minister Boris Johnson and Kerry Simons also made the trip to Scotland as it is customary for British leaders to visit the Queen there every year. The Queen spends Christmas at Sandringham Estate in Norfolk and when she is working she splits her time between Buckingham Palace and Windsor Castle. However, Balmoral is said to be where the monarch is most at home. Surrounded by stunning countryside away from prying eyes, the Queen can truly relax. Every summer Prince Philip and the Queen usually spend about a week away from the castle in one of Balmoral's secluded guesthouses, Craig Gown Lodge. 